A local hospital known for their trauma care helping San Antonio in the fight against COVID-19 with their ECMO program. The medical procedure is used as an alternative to putting someone on a ventilator. Brook Army Medical Center revealed it is treating civilian COVID-19 patients through this program. The night team's Tiffany Huertas has a look at the hospital's involvement during the pandemic. We, we have doubled our capacity for ECMO uh, uh, over the last couple weeks to greater support the city uh, because it's, it's a specialized uh, uh, treatment. Air Force Colonel Patrick Osborne says Brook Army Medical Center is treating five civilian COVID-19 patients through their ECMO program. As those people get better and come off the machine, then we will take more. So how does BAMC identify civilian COVID-19 patients for this program? We have our own uh, separate ECMO contact line and so that the hospitals in the area know and, and they contact us directly through that. Local leaders have asked for more help from BAMC as hospitals get closer to capacity. That would help us a, a great deal if they would start taking uh, start taking patients. But Osborne says it's out of their control. If those decisions are, are made way outside this building uh, uh, by federal entities and and basically we are on the receiving end of uh, we have to be ready for whatever mission we are given by our military chain of command or civilian chain of command um, and, and those decisions uh, we have really no control over. Bamsey says they are taking on additional trauma patients to ensure the region's trauma response remains unaffected by the pandemic. We've taken more and more as, as other hospitals in town have uh, uh, had more COVID to deal with than we have. Osborne says San Antonians must do their part to continue to stop the spread of COVID-19. The number of critically ill patients, the number of patients on ECMO, the number of patients on ventilators in ICUs, that continues to rise. Tiffany Huertas, KSAT 12 News. Well, about 100